Stopping through, clicking on the video, and checking out your boy Jay the Sneaky Guy once again. And welcome to those who are stopping through for the first time, man. Y'all go ahead, hit that subscribe button if y'all are checking out any of the content. We will keep you guys satisfied and fulfilled over here, man. We got a lot of dope, dope things coming. And uh, as you guys see from this video, we got early reviews and dope on feats. We got vlogs, everything, man. So y'all come on, be a part of the family because we are on the grind over here to 3,000 subscribers by the end of July. July has just started, so we got to grind, 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 and um, it's a blessing, man. We uh, broke 1,800 subscribers. Uh, I think it was the day before yesterday, or it might have been yesterday, but it's a blessing, man. I thank you guys for showing the love, and we're going to go ahead and take off. But today, y'all, uh, we got the Jordan 5 Inspires or Michigans, whatever y'all want to call them. We got those, as y'all seen from the title and the intro, and yeah, we're going to be going ahead and getting into those. So uh, let's go ahead and start out with the box, y'all. And um, before I get into this, man, uh, as you guys can see in the background, I got a whole bunch of different uh, shoes, yellow shoes at that. And the reason is because I want to show you guys the difference in the uh, color yellow of these fives, man. Because uh, as you can see, the Ferraris, that's like the most dark yellow out of them all. But I even, I'm kind of hiding those, but you see these fives, these uh, University Gold Ones, the Lowe's. They are probably the closest to the uh, the Michigan Fives, but they're not even close. But as far as what you see here, they're the closest because it's like a light shaded yellow. But we're going to go ahead and get more into that. Also got the 17s, which is way off in color, but we're going to go ahead and get into that. But back to this box, y'all, you get this special type of box that you do uh, when you got some special type of Jordans. But uh, you got that with decorations. Y'all already know this box. Show to see y'all a million and one times. Going on to the size tagging of them, y'all. Get some focus. All right, y'all. These do have a QR code, as you guys see over here. Uh, but it reads Air Jordan Retro SE Special Edition is what that stands for, I believe. This is a size 9, so y'all know that it's personal pair. This is for me. And these retail at that 225 price point. But uh, I don't know, y'all. That's gonna make or break these shoes. But that's the box, y'all. Going into the box, y'all have the same presentation as I do normally get with these type of boxes. You got the black paper underneath that. You got white paper. If it shows, you got white paper under that. And uh, these do have a you know a quality control sticker in this box. And uh, I believe that that's the only sticker that this box has, y'all. But that does it for the quick presentation of the box, y'all. And uh, bam. We got an early look at the Jordan 5 Inspire or Michigans. And uh, yeah, man, first impression on these, y'all, I like them, man. I like them a lot. You know, I'm not the biggest 5 person because they, on my feet, I, I believe that they're kind of bulky fitting, you know. But I just, I like these shoes. These are one of the 5s that I do like. So, uh very dope man uh we're gonna go ahead and get into this review on these and as i said y'all i'm gonna give y'all a quick look y'all see that background y'all see the color the color differential of those shoes that i have up there so y'all will kind of know where these stand out and like i said uh with the the university gold ones i guess because it's kind of far away it might be showing a little s similarity in that color but it's not really a similarity so you, you see the 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 color way of them from right here and you can see how dark that yellow is on those lows but let's go ahead and get into it y'all starting with the outsole man you got this translucent this icy blue outsole on these with your navy blue jump man ducked off right there you got your navy blue hit lip at the top 
you got your Jordan that is written in navy. And uh, these shoes are not black, y'all. Everywhere that you think is black is a navy blue. So moving up, y'all, to the midsole on these, you have a navy blue midsole that goes all the way around. You got that navy blue hit. Then it goes into that yellow colorway that they got, that Michigan yellow. Got that there with your speckles. That has your navy blue speckles in that. Under that, you got your head of that icy that comes up from the bottom, that icy sole. And uh, your air system on this one, it is like that, uh, like a sail inside there. Like a sail type of color. But you got that, man. Moving up, y'all, to the, uh, the quality. Like the, this is New Buck, I believe. Or, sorry, this may be suede. This is suede on these, y'all. And it is, it is very, very nice suede on these. It's very nice to the touch. Uh, smooth to the touch. I'm sorry. And uh, as you guys can see, y'all see you got that that two tone motion going on right there. So it's very very soft, nice uh suede they have on these. Give y'all a quick close up of how that looks. Very smooth, very smooth. And as y'all can see, man, from what I'm showing y'all, the craftsmanship on these are not bad. Because I mean, I got a little glue stain right there, as you can see. But besides that. It ain't really too much going on, man. So these are, you know, not badly crafted, you know, to say. I don't see any more glue stains. And uh, let's stop right here. Take a look at this tag on the back, which I like, man. You got your quality uh, product inspired by the greatest basketball player ever on the back. That's a dope touch, man, because I like how, you know, the red, gray, black contrast pops on the back, and it's just something different other than a jump, man, that's normally on the back of your Jordan 5. So I like that touch, and it's uh outlined with that dark yellow stitching you got. So that is a dope touch, y'all. Going over to the side, y'all, and your meshing, you got that white uh, mesh, clear mesh with your navy background in there. Moving on from that, y'all, moving up to the lacing system, you have your navy blue laces with your tongue that has that uh, translucent clear little piece on that behind it. Going up to your uh, lace lock, you got that clear lace lock with your uh, navy blue holder, like the lace holder in there. And it has a, what color is that? That's like a... It's not really yellow. It's like a golden jump man you got in there. Moving up past that, y'all, you got your jump man with your uh, 3M hits all around that. And that's navy. And this whole upper, as you guys know, is 3M. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how the 3M looks on these shoes. Uh, y'all can check that out right there. That's how it looks. So you also have 3M hits down here at the bottom. That little lip right, lip right there. Apologize. That has a uh, 3M hits on it. So you got 3M right here at the bottom as well as on your tongue. So that's how that looks. That 3M hit on those, y'all. And uh, that's a very dope touch for them to put that 3M down there, y'all. I like that. But uh, moving on, y'all. These are dope, man. These are clean. But moving on past that, y'all. Into the inside of the shoe, y'all. Behind the tongue, where you normally have your Air Jordan, it says Inspire, hence to the name of the shoe. You got Inspire right there. And uh, this material, man, as y'all can see, like the, the, the pattern of that, that is dope, man. All on the interior, you have that going in there. And then uh, that interior pattern also goes down into the insole. So you got that same type of pattern as you guys can see. You got that same pattern on the insole, y'all. And then you have a, a navy blue jump man right there on the bottom let me uh, try to loosen this up so i can give you a better look on the inside y'all uh go ahead loosen it up a little bit take this out i got my shoe tree cardboard shoe tree size nine so this is a nine through nine and a half got that there and uh where is the size tagging on these dang okay the size tagging is way down on the bottom i don't know if i'm gonna be able to show y'all this one but uh if you guys can peep in there a little bit can kind of kind of see it all right you have a qr style size tagging on these i can't get too much in there to give y'all the look that i want to give y'all but uh i'm gonna do the best that i can without creasing up my shoes well it ain't it ain't really gonna work y'all but the manufacturing date on these is from february 6th of this year through may 2nd of this year so 
me try that one more time. Nah, it ain't gonna work. But uh, yeah, that's that's the production dates on these, y'all. And uh, as I said, y'all, my 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 honest opinion on these, man, they is dope, man. They are dope. I like these shoes, y'all. I, I can't I can't front on these, man. Um, they are some dope Jordan fives. And uh, my prediction on them, if they would sell out, man, I think I think that they gonna sell out. Uh, especially on Nike, they might not sell out as fast on like in in your stores in person because you know how that go. But uh, uh, I don't see them sitting around for no week or nothing. They gonna they gonna sell. The only thing that's gonna kind of be kind of the the deal breaker on these is that two twenty five price point. But to be honest, y'all, I feel like two twenty five for these isn't isn't bad given the fact that you get a premium box and you get something different on these Jordan 5s. This isn't, this isn't your regular Jordan 5. This is like, you know, this is something, it's, it's, it's different. You know, you got your tag on the back, you know, you got the, this nice suede on it, and uh, the, the quality craftsmanship on it looks like it's, it's real good, y'all. So, I mean, I would say that they're worth that price point, but if y'all out here, you know, spending 190, 200, all this money on shoes very frequent this might be a deal breaker for y'all because j just like okay let me give y'all an example the the reflections of a champion that pack i feel like that wasn't worth the money honest opinion because uh it's it's nothing really special about it except for a whole 3m shoe 3m material is not that expensive for them to jack that price up but uh this, I mean, it might be not that expensive to make this type of shoe, but it's just, just, just the difference of this shoe. On those reflections of a champion pack, you know, you just had a Jordan 6, you just had a Jordan 7, and you just had a Jordan 8. It was nothing different about it. This is a Jordan 5 with a little twist, with a little tag on the back, and uh, just this colorway. This, this looks like a, a more of a premium shoe, y'all, but... Video's already long enough as it is. Y'all ain't gonna talk y'all head off. I know y'all ready to see that on feet. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, leave y'all with that on feet. But yeah, that's my honest opinion on these, man. I, I think that they're dope. Um, I will be wearing these and I also will be putting some damn soul protectors on the bottom of these because I'm gonna try to keep these clean. But uh, yes, y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed that, man. If this is your first time, like I said, stopping through, y'all make sure y'all hit that subscribe button. Join the family. Stay tuned. Hit that notification bell because these videos is gonna be coming non-stop y'all stay blessed and uh till my next video your boy jay the sneaky guys checking out with the early look of the jordan 5 inspire or michigan's but uh till my next video y'all i'm gone peace <laughs>